everybody what is up and today is going to be your second VB script tutorial so let's get started now what we're going to be covering today are variables and different box types so this program is going to be a question and response type system in which the question is going to be do you like pi if you answer yes the program is going to come back to you with a message saying that's great and if you answer no the message is going to be that's too bad for you so let's get started as always we start off with MHD box and what's going to ask is do you like pi now for our box types I will link an image in the description below to a whole different bunch of box types. I believe there are about 70, but we obviously don't have time to cover all of them. So our three main ones today are number 36, a question yes or no, number 16, a critical okay, and number 64, an informational okay. So for our initial MSG box, we are going to use box type number 36, a question yes or no. For our title, we're going to put some questions. Now, we've all seen variables in things like math and programming, for instance, like batch files or HTML or JavaScript. Now, if we look back at our image, we see at the very top button value, OK equals 1, cancel equals 2, abort equals 3, retry equals 4, ignore equals 5, yes equals 6, and no equals 7. The bottom two are in particular interest for us today, yes and no. So we're going to set our initial MSG box to equal x. Now obviously you can make that any variable you want. We're going to say if x equals 6 or yes, then MSG box. That's great. We're going to set that box type to 64. I'm going to say if x equals 7 or a no then msd box that's too bad for you i'm going to set that box type to 16. now one key thing here is in your initial msd box you are going to have to have brackets around your do you like pi your box type and your title otherwise your program will crash so we'll set that. Now we're just going to save. As you can see, the program has asked us, do you like pi? Let's say we say yes. You can say that's great. If we answer no, you can say that's too bad for you. Now that will be your second VBScript tutorial. Please make sure to subscribe and like for new episodes.